Kim not are dating right. So, celebrate the players with six card packs. We will open them later. Challenge a friend to a game in any mode as well. Um, literally, I have two people added, and um, I don't think one of them even plays Hearthstone anymore. So, yeah, I don't think that's happening. Rogue Warrior. So, Rogue or Warrior. Okay, so there's some cards that have been changed as well. Um, stream, why are you not coming up? Why are you not live? Are we not live? Oh, shit. Um, one second. I need to change the delay to not be 300 seconds. <laughs> okay, so these are the official channels, just checking that's all still working right. So now hopefully that will catch up. Okay, awkwardly. It's going to catch up in um, five minutes, so sorry, chat. Um, you can't change that on the fly, right? So four new cards have been added to the classic set. You now craft them or find them in classic packs. So Icicle, deal 2 damage to a minion if it's frozen, draw a card. Add a random mage spell to your hand, turn Vintlex for 1, that's, that's pretty good. Add a random demon to your hand, and uh, Pilver, add a random card to your hand from your opponent's class. Okay, with a uh, Dangies and Joker in the back. So, it's the Hearthstone Tambor. So I need to nap, I forgot I had one. Send in the Murlocs. Murlocs are taken over the tavern. Choose a class and get a random deck of spells. The whole mess of Murlocs. So tough for so long I forgot who. Rogue or Warrior. So freezing. But I bought these reduced to clear, um, God, five days ago. And I forgot I had them because they were at the back of the fridge burned behind all the shit. And, um, yeah. They're still in pretty good condition, but if I don't eat the apples, they will start to go off, so... I had plans to eat them. <laughs> they're still pretty good condition, you know, they're not even remotely bruised or knackered at all. Also in the UK, so apples are green here. Apples are green here. Sure, sure, why not? Why not? That seems all useful. So... Stream will eventually catch up, sorry for the chat delay. Um, I will see the chat come up live though, but it will be like five minutes behind native action. What was that? We got a quest? Hmm, 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 hmm. I'm gonna hold off. Hail, friend. Although I can play that next Hello. turn, yeah sure. I mean, if I play that next turn, we get that. Okay, so summon 10 Murlocs, we get Megafin. Okay, so fill your hand with a Murloc. So these are the official channels, by the way, if you're watching elsewhere. Someone stole my content. That's a pretty good thing to get if you want a lot of Murlocs. Give your other Murlocs plus two health. Actually, that's going to override that. Keeps my guy alive. Keeps my guy alive and fighting. Then we will do that. And he'll get plus two attack and plus two health. So he'll be really good. A plus one attack. Well, you know, he'll be a 4-6. Oof. Oof. A tactical error. I mean, I do that. I kill that one. I kill that one. I'm going to have to trade with that one. It was a tactical error. My friend, a tactical error. So I will see chat, like I said, the action is going to be five minutes behind because um, I forgot to change that beforehand. See the kill, go for the kill. One HP lost each, but you're going to be losing a lot more soon. Give random in just one Murloc. Hmm. I mean, I also have a Razor Petal that can kill that guy. So that's not really helpful for you. That's also pretty stupid. Um, whoops. Give your weapon life steal. I mean, if I do this, I can trade with that and get rid of it, and it... Mm. I mean, will that cause my guy to die? I don't know. It's just battle cry, so it's only native, so it won't. But it's good to keep that guy alive, because he will give everything plus one damage for all our minions. They're all going to be Murlocs of some sort. Even that's a Murloc. It's an amalgamation, but, you know, it's still a Murloc. Also, I can give my weapon life steal, but I don't think that's really great. 
Well, well, well. Well, well, well. Shuffle 10 cards from your opponent's class into your deck. It's not 10 of his cards, though. It's 10 of his class cards. Justice is mine. Mm -hmm. I think it's going to be better to save that for next turn. I mean, we will get literally three Murlocs next turn. And the stream of starters. And, um, oh my god, it's... Okay, <laughs> it had frozen for a second. I was like, okay, it's not even doing anything. Yeah, okay, okay. Summon ten Murlocs. Well, I'm going to suddenly go up a lot here. I'm going to summon... Wow, he's so close. What does Megafin do again? Fill your hand with random one That's not that great. Well, ooh, ooh. I mean, you know, we could do spicy things from that, but... We're going to echo this guy, Echo Beach, far away. In time. We're just getting maximum equity for our guy here. And I might as well attack your face. <coughs> I mean, Megafin isn't really going to do a lot for Euro, I don't think. I think, you know, my way of playing is better. He could trade his 3 2 into that, he really should. Or, he could do that. That also works. He finally gets rid of my guy. Hmm, so, 4, 5, 6, 7. Well, I, I'm going to do this. It's an interesting play. Then I'll do that. And then I play my Justice cup of greed. <laughs> yeah, you hate ten greeds. My cup of greed. With a piece of apple in my cheek like this, I look really huge and fat on the stream, which is nice. Oh my god. I need to get on the treadmill again. That's a five cost eight eight. That's pretty spicy. That's pretty spicy. We only need to play four, bro. Right? That's pretty bad. For every other Murloc on the battlefield card. Right, so there are four. Okay, so if I played you, then that. Okay, if I play that, then that, then that. Mm, no. I'll play that, then... Mm, no, I'll play that. Mm, bollocks. There's no way, good way of doing it. No good way of doing it. I kind of want to give them all plus health, but at the same time, it's like... This is the smartest way, but we still lose somehow. Okay, so it's an 8 charge. Now it's a 9-6 charge, okay. So that really needs to die. And 6, I mean, 8-6, I should really just go for his face, right? 3, 6, 7. Now he has to trade with me, and it will eliminate both of his. And we've still got a spicy field. Megafin doesn't charge, right? No. Just random Murlocs to your hands. Random Murlocs to your hands! Something could save you. Something could save you. But if not, I think I got lethal. You're feeding me pretty hard. You are feeding me pretty hard here. Yeah. You're going to have to trade your Murlocs into my 10-6. <coughs> okay, so that does eliminate some of his damage as well. But... You really need to trade both your cards into him. Mm, he's still going to be pretty spicy. Mm, okay, so if I charge, he becomes a 7-8-9. 10. Whoops. Now you'd think that's a whoops. 15, right, so 10 8. If I do 6, 7. So he becomes an 8 then, and that keeps him alive. And then I trade that with yours. Got a zero cost. I trade that with you. Oh, you were bragging, weren't you? 
tactical error. Whoops. We're even, and I have a better field. You thought you had won? I think not. Okay, that's an annoying one that we need to get rid of. Okay, maybe we're dead. Maybe we're dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just get on with it, you BM fool. No need to BM. I mean, come on. At least it wasn't a rope in twat, but still, you know, it's a bit of BM. For sure. Play 10 demons! Well, we didn't, did we? We did not. We didn't get any of those one cost cards either. Like right, the one cost spells, you know, that would have saved us like Pyro. Pyro Blast, 10 damage to your face for one, would have saved us. There are probably other mage spells that could have saved us as well. I wonder if um the secret that makes you immune to lethal might have been in that. You know, it's like you can never tell with Tumble. Sometimes the old card can be made. Return any spells you cast on this minion. Hmm. I'm gonna recycle to try and get some spells to put on him. Or we just get another primal from champion. That'll also do. Hail, friend. Whenever another friendly minion Murloc dies, draw a card when all of our minions can be Murloc, so that could also work. And then playing it with health. So I can put both of those out in turn four. Okay, that's pretty interesting. Mm. I mean, I'm gonna get rid of that. Just because he's gonna cause us a lot of trouble. We're not here for trouble. Arm. Arm. My name is Arm. Mm. As a reference, some people won't get. <laughs> okay, so they all went on that one. Discover a new hero power, you say. We're not gonna kill that again. We'll put that out there. It's not too bad. So I was considering the hero power now, but I think that's probably the right move. Hope for some spells to put on him. We seem to be lacking them at the moment. Only one, you are at three. Next turn, though, I can do that and get that out there. And that's going to be a spicy start. It's going to cost me some health, but it's a good start. Uh, the cold light see it. He doesn't kill it. He doesn't kill it. Oh, we're only at three. When a friendly minion dies, return to your cost two, your other Murlocs have plus self. Summon a taunt. Okay, that, that's going to work. And then we'll discover a new hero of power. It's going to be the summon a Murloc, of course. Of course it isn't. No, no. Why would it ever be that? Gain two armor or Totemic Call? I think Totemic Call is right because of the healing potential. Okay, so we've cut that for a turn. That's good. I wonder if that counts as a casting a spell on it. You know, if it triggers a secret, it's not really a secret. It's a secret, not a spell. Wow. Okay, so we got through my turn with that. Not surprising. And he's just going for all of my minions. He really wants board control, doesn't he? Interesting. I mean, he'll have to waste his fireballs to do this. But I think that's right. I mean, he can kill his Cold Light Oracle. He can kill that with a fireball and keep the Oracle alive, and then I'll have to trade. It's entirely up to him what he wants to do. He, he should probably go for my special one. Now he can kill it outright and still survive. 
And he's got spells to use on that. Mm. So we don't get any card here. And he freezes it. Hmm. Okay. So, if I do that, I can't summon anything. Well, I can. I can summon the key shit. Okay. It's not so bad. We just need to hold out for Flame Strike, really. Now, Flame Strike can wipe his hands and keep our board clear. But he's going for trade, so. It's not really that ideal. He goes for a cheap one. Okay, if I do that, it doesn't really help. Hmm. Hmm. I don't think we're in a very great position here. I mean, I can do this and still get this out there. But we're already dead anyway. We are literally dead. He might go board control, but... Wouldn't really be clever. <laughs> Would not be clever. That's all. Right, so I've got a tower here as well, by the way. And he's going for BM, maybe. BM. BM. Major BM. Because he had lethal. And just like, why even play that? Why even play that? Um. Why oh, did you play that? <laughs> right, so no one's in the chat at the moment, but you know, if you're welcome to come join. Let's go with a warrior. The warrior was the other one. We want to get a win out there. It's like, you know, it's like we're suffering with that at the moment. Not really being very helpful. And my neighbour kicked on my door earlier. Sorry, he kicked down my door like a twat. It's like, why, why? Why did you come and just kick on my door whilst I was trying to make a cup of tea? And I was like, what the fuck was that? Well, uh, you came out and kicked my door for no reason, great. Drunken twat. Sick of this alcoholic drunken twat, you know, it's like, not necessary at all, right? Because that's Echo, we really want it later. Life steal again, you know, might be worth later, but it's a one cost that we can get out there. But Echo will definitely be much better later. We can get some multiple Merlops going on with that. That will not be too bad. Not too bad at all. Sandstorm. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah. <laughs> we can defeat the Sandstorm with Darude's behaviour. Get it. <laughs> okay, your other Merlops have plus one attack. Big one. <coughs> Enjoy meeting my Merlop. He will hit my face, but... I mean, you know, smart actually for you to take out my minion. He did. With that, that, that's actually a clever move for this ball, I can see. Right, Puddle Stomper. And he did that before attacking me, so it didn't give us anything. Okay, so I'm going to do this one first. Okay, okay, there's some spicy meta. We could bounce and Blade next turn and 100% get rid of that if he's going to do board control like this. Also, if he super buffs it. But um, he should stab and use his minion. They're not Treants with taunts. Okay. So I can charge and take out the Treants. Yeah. It's a smart thing to do. Right, so take out the Treants. So take out the Get rid of that problem. We don't have Tor minions, so it'd be pointless using that. Right, so now he can choose to stab his Trient into me, or I can do more damage to his face, or he can just do damage to himself like that. For board control. And then changes that hero power, even though it's pretty overpowered, and now you've gone for damaging yourself. Oof, I feel like you messed up that. I do feel like you messed up that. Right, so I can take out you. Mm -hmm. Is it worth wasting that on him? I don't think so. 
I don't think it's worth wasting that on just him. But next turn he will have more minions and they will all be more damaged. Now it's worth it because it 50 50 chance of hitting that as well. Without a weak minion out there. So something is going to get. Or it can just kill that. <laughs> that also works. <coughs> It is not quite as intended, but it works. And now you can't stab my minion to death always. Ooh, freeze that Four, five, six, seven. And he trades it, okay. You'd have to throw everything into it, it'd be pretty dumb. I just want to get my discovery anyway. Deal one damage could be useful. Sure, could be useful. Alright, so we're no longer frozen. He would have to trade all of his minions into us to take care of that. He's going to get a lot of minions out here, so he's literally going to get to his mega food. He didn't trade them all into it. Interestingly, he went for one. But we needed the card for a bit, so you know, that actually helped me. Right, so I can definitely deal one damage to that. So I'm going to discover a tall minion first though. I feel like that's absolutely the right move actually. It's only when another friendly Murloc dies, right, so... Uh, yeah. Two, four, six, eight. I mean, you know, it's like two spare. Mm -hmm. mm, nah, I, I was considering attacking one of his minions, but I don't think that's the right move. Right, so I could have also done deal one damage to that with the Blowgill Sniper, but he's going to trade within now, so, you know, it doesn't really pay off. Right, so he is still not quite there with Megafin. Anything three or less, and he gets that, but then he can't play it. Okay, that's annoying. Maybe I should have traded. That was an error. Okay, now we just get destroyed on that as well. Well, well, well. I will crush you. He's already gone. <laughs> That's overpowered as a combination, isn't it? Yes. Just a little. Just a little. Okay, so let's go with Warrior again. Give Warrior one more chance. Then we'll do something like Mage. I don't know. Or something that we think might stand a chance of winning rather than just our quests. <laughs> and try and get our pack. And we've already got several packs that we can get to win. So, you know, it's not like we're going to lose with that. Also, I'm very ill because the shit edge upstairs leave their windows open all fucking day and freeze the house out, and the instant I turn the heat on, they fling them even wider open and just freeze the house out, and they're just complete swaps. Replace your deck with copies of Discover a Card. Hum! <laughs> I'm going to super meme on this one, and we're just gonna. We're just not going to play the Brawl. I mean, we've got a quest. Greetings. But, I'm going to super meme on this entire tambour and go, no. I am playing a different game. I will defeat you by being a Discover deck. Okay, so we've got a few Merlocks still. Ooh. That's, that's an unusually spicy one. Weapons Project. Okay, well, we could discover a card. Mm, they don't have charge today, so I'm not going to. Although, we've got nothing else to do, so. 3 2, yeah, that's the smartest thing to do. They're both 1 health, we've got 2 1 health minions. And even trained, he can actually stab one of them, but still. You know, next turn's the right move because it's turn a three cost card. Although he can also do that with a sniper. 
Is he not even gonna play at all? I was gonna say. What? What? What is that? Oh, I was gonna say. Ooh. It's all non murlocs though. It's like, hmm, hmm. I mean, everything is gonna be murlocs. Three two murloc. It's not a smart one. <laughs> Let's just discover a card. Okay. Taunts can't be targeted by spells or hero powers, or the Grim Patron could take a lot of damage, or we can inspire a lot. Inspiration might hit us. I think Inspiration might be a good idea, because we'll gain armor and summon a silver hand recruit. So that could be pretty good. It's an inspirational move by not even playing the tambour at hand. The Shroom Brewer might be next turn, or it might be both of these. Or it might be one of these and this. I'll see. I mean, that kills his weapon anyway, you know, so he already has a weapon, but we might as well do something inspirational. Mm. 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 The weapon might help him get rid of my thing. I'm just gonna put both of my things out there. Get the job done. Turn five, we could do that and inspire. I'll see what his board looks like at that point. If we want to start going full defense mode. What have you got to play? I mean, I'm never going to get to my 10. Let's see if we can defeat him before then. We are in the winning position. Okay, a good board wipe would actually be pretty good. So I might want to discover a card. Restore health. It'd be smart. Counter spell? Hmm, could be counter spell. You are very slow at playing all of your attacks. You are, like, super slow. Okay, we could discover something pretty good. If you're on a dragon game rush, whenever a friendly minion takes damage, gain one armor. Hmm. Okay. That is what we're going to do. We're going to gain a fair bit of armor here. Okay, we could get charged, give your taunt minions or battle cries or rush life steal. Well, you know, we don't have any of those. The charge could be useful. Sure. Okay. So we're going to gain up some armor. And I'm going to trade with the 1 1 just because it's better efficacy. <coughs> no, you need to trade with me, really. Otherwise, you're in a bad position. I mean, you know, we're, we're just coming up on from behind. Deal 1 damage. Well, that still gives me another armor. You still really need to. Well, that wipes out the armor, but it wasn't really ideal. Dagger? Chelsea dagger? Hmm. You're just going heavy for my face, let's see. It's not really helping you out too much, is it? I mean, you know, he does literally almost have lethal. Ooh, yes, okay. Raw face is also pretty good. Boss. Hello. Strike. You cannot kill me. It's all the matters, we don't have lethal right. So he will have to trade two of his minions and himself stabbing me, or all of his minions, to get rid of that. To be honest, that's a good deal to me. It's a pretty good deal. Right, so he did he go for the first hit on himself. And he will trade both of them, we'll gain two armor. He's got the inspire though, that's not great. I don't like that. But I can charge straight into that, okay. So you'll only get one inspire out of it. Don't give me another. He trades with that. That's a fair enough trade. But 
I'm going to croak and charge into that because it needs to happen. Us. At the same time, we need to first see what else we can get. Diehorn, not bad. You're damaged, you're not damaged. So we got rid of that problem. Now we're just going to armor up a bit to try and survive. That takes the damage out of that guy. This is what we're going to do next, though. The dire horn, actually. It's a bit more interesting. But we're just playing two different tambrels here, mate. You, you, you're trying to get this um, mega fin, whereas I'm just never going to get it. Never going to get it, never going to get it. We're playing a discover deck. We're playing a discover ball. That's all we are doing. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's unfortunate. Five, six, seven, eight. Shuffle 10 cards from my class into your thing. Hmm. Where have I seen that one before? Okay, you've also got some echoes to get more cards into your hands. Well... Yeah, you, you've got zero mana left. You can't play whatever you found that was miraculous to help you out there. Okay, so my taunt is going to go out there. And I think that's a good move. Well, You're protected, and then we can start getting some inspiration to actually get that. And then I can actually heal myself up a bit. All we have to do is survive this turn. One damage to all minions, okay. Mm. You got through that, but you're going to cause one damage to your own, and that's not helpful. But you don't get the battle cries. But that shouldn't really came towards your quests in my opinion. That shouldn't came towards your quests. It's a bit unfortunate that it counts towards your quests. Okay. Okay. Overpower as much. Okay. Wind Fury, swap the attack and health of a minion. None of these are really great. Okay. Whenever a minion takes damage, gain plus one attack. Gain plus one health for each minion, for each enemy minion. And it's a taunt. Okay. And um, I think this is the smart time to do this. So I can start getting some board control. That kills your thing, actually. So that was actually smarter than I intended. <laughs> smarter than I intended. Right, so if he summons some Murlocs, that's going to cause us some problems. So I might as well kill this one so that it's got less damage. Purge them all. With the gear blades. <coughs> but that was a smart move. It's smarter than I intended. That's not great. That's not great that we cause that to happen. So we'll get some card draw. He's also going to get some health. But that's good for me, getting more choose your own paths. Four, five, six, seven. Right, so he's got lethal on my guy. Unfortunately. So there goes our protection. He's going to choose to use his gear blades. He also sacrificed his strong minion. Right, so six. We definitely need a taunt. We need some sort of tool to be in our best position here. But our discovers are good, and you know, if in doubt, we can always heal up some extra health and survive a bit. Right, so, we have four, five, six, seven, eight at the end of the day. What an odd move. You're that desperate for card draw that you had to waste that. Hmm. Destroy an enemy minion with two or less attack. Not really that great, but we will take it. Okay. Also, damages next to whomever he attacks at the end of your turn. Some of the 1 1 Scarab and Taunts. Yeah, I think that's the right move. Okay. Magnetic taunt. Gain plus one health for each spell in your hand. Well, we could farm a lot of spells in hand. Magnetic taunt, not 
great, but it's a taunt and, um, well, 1-5. You could kill it with your 2-6, or I could kill that, and then you've got to use all of them, and you still get through. But... I think that's the right move. Alright, so now you need to trade many of your minions, or your 6-6 six, six gets wasted a turn, to not get through. So that keeps us alive a bit. With uh, 13 health, you're at 27. Mm, it's not great. Gabby! Gabby, Gabby, Gabby. What are you doing to me? And you've still got a secret. Oh, wow. That changes everything. <laughs> 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. You have exactly even. Just finish it. And rule its ashes. Now he's got a stronger weapon to definitely finish this, but you had exactly even. You didn't need to do that. I'm not going to BM and, you know, deny anything. But. <laughs> We were fighting, like, not the actual town wall as well, like, we came to discover for some reason. I decided that was a good idea. Right, so let's go one with mage, then we'll open up axe, and if I don't lose, I'll just do it off camera. For my own time, you know, it's like, hey, wasting a million years trying to do a town wall. It's like, you've got to keep it under an hour long video as well. It's like, I don't like huge long videos. I know I'm live streaming as well, but um, yeah, I just like to break it down a bit smaller. Death is what you will get, not victory. You will get only death! Victory or death, you get death. That is what you will get. Right, so we're going to do a lot better with mage spells. We Hello. will do a lot better with mage spells. Okie dokie. Lower! You are lower in quality of enemy than they were. So we can get two enemies out there, or we can charge. It will depend on what he will play. If you play something with two health and a lot of damage, we'll charge into it. If not, we'll play the level. Charge directly into it, it is! Bye bye! The next turn we get to do that and have a lot of minions out there. Unless it's something with one health. Ooh, that was a good one to turn. Whoops. That actually played right into my hand. Okay. Alright, so reveal a spell from your deck. Deal damage equal to its cost of all minions. Okay, that's pretty bad. <coughs> but we will roll retort. Unless we've got something really good, isn't it? Just to get the um, extra damage into our deck already. And the upstairs neighbors have opened a fucking window and throws the house out again. Instantly throws the house out like taps. Okay. Change the cost of the minions in your deck to one. As overpaid. It's Luna's Pocket Galaxy. Wow. We will just have all one cost minions. Hell no. Um, you can play two of those Echo Beach, but I will protect my guy. I will protect my guy in a different way. You are no match, my friends. Lower. I'm a mage player, <laughs> clearly. Or I'm also a beastmaster. You know, the beast deck is pretty sweet in this turn. I don't know what the next expansion is going to be like. Well, you know, that's going to be traded with straight away. It's going to be traded with as well. That's plus one attack for each other. They're not on the battlefield. I've got some spicy plays if I want to do them right, so... Sure. I mean... <laughs> I'm still going to trade with you. But um, I just wanted the extra damage on him before I did that. I mean, um, yeah, I think you chose right. <laughs> we were winning that, no problem. <laughs> okay, so will we get one of the new cards in the classic pack? 
two rares for ancient maze, vaporize, not the new stuff. Mark of nature. And then we got six of the newer packs. What do we get? Oh rare. So we got Dead Ringer, draw a Death Rass minion from the deck. Taunt Life Steel. We've got a magnetic glowtron, summon two 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 triumphs, and give all demons in your hand plus one plus one. We've got cards that them on a flip. Um, battle cry gain self until next turn. Add a random elemental to your hand. Two two for a two cost. That's pretty good. Um, for my sort of meta. With Cleaner. Um, upgradable flame bot because it will be a random elemental. It could be a better one. And elementals have life steal, and it's two for two two. And that's not bad. An um, upgradable flame bot for one five. I guess it's just you know using any sort of upgrades you have. Summon a zero eight robo. Oh, sorry, an eight eight robo saw. Okay. Give the leftmost minion in your hand plus two plus two. So you know any of these could get plus two to plus two. Just keep them on the left hand side of your deck. You can't, of course, choose where they are in your hand. Golden Rare Test Subject. Return any spells you cast on this minion to your hand. For one, it's a zero two. That's not bad. Each player gains two. I wonder if it counts that in while it's in your hand, you know, before it's played. That'd be interesting. I think it should. You know, each player gains two mana crystals. You know, the leftmost card. Give it plus two, plus two. Summon two one two mechs with taunts and divine shields for seven. That is goddamn awful. Um, give a mech plus one plus one, and that's not mech class. That's just an inventor. Summon a copy of each adjacent minion. That's not bad. You know you can get some pretty spicy minions with that. It's a very situational eight cost though. You know, you'd have to have some really good cards to do that. The magnetism, though, you know, if you have magnetism cards that are by that, you can really get some usefulness out of it. Torn Life Steel. Whenever this takes damage, gain plus two armor. Okay. Um, draw seven, eight, nine, and ten cost minion from your deck for four. Interesting. Interesting. You know, you could play it early and get some expensive cards that you might not play, or you could get it late and draw a lot of cards that you could play, but nothing that you could play that turn because it's not a six cost. A magnetic Poisonous Venomizer. Again, you know, you could super magnetize something huge. Summon three Microbops. And Magnetic, obviously. Okay, so we've got a Dendrologist. If you control a Triant, discover a spell. Okay. Each player equips a 2-3 weapon and 6 armor. We use those in this tavern brawl. Spell damage plus 2 for a 4-3 four, for 4. Not bad, I guess. Um, deal 1 damage to all minions. Overload 2. I hate overloads. Like, even for 0 cost, that's not really great. Although, if it's 2 cost to all minions. It's not that bad. Right. So we've got a few gold in this system. Discover a copy of a minion in your opponent's deck. Interesting. Gain plus one attack for each damage your hero has taken this turn. That could get a lot of damage, to be honest. In some of the spicy plays some people play. If you give that charge as well, that would just be huge. Like, you know, you can do things to give things charge. Deal one damage to the minion and the minion is next to it. Rush. And whenever this minion takes damage, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, given that rush, and if you've taken a lot of damage that turn, but not quite lethal, you know, especially when they go into the whole um, boost their minions and they just go bush, 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 and you just take like 29 damage, but you've got one HP left. You know, that that could be really spicy. So, four rare and 22 common. It's been a while since I've taken characters. Anyway, that was today's Tambrol. So, join us again for some more. Goodbye. And then we need to go click stop streaming. So bye-bye, see you later.